ericmothersmother.com. Let's take a look at Nintendo, and this is the daily chart. Just want to take a look at how it formed this intraday highs here. In fact, we can see a fresh daily closing high right there. But now keep in mind that when this was taking shape, we have this improvement on a day-to-day -day basis. But take a look at your RSI. Your RSI is essentially making lower highs. Now you'll notice here when we make this intraday closing high, or let's say a closing high, not an intraday closing high, but this closing high comes with the RSI trading well below, or let's say below 61.8. So yes, it is negative divergence where we see price improving, but the technicals deteriorating or making lower highs. That negative divergence is the main reason, but it is the power of the fact that when you make this high, you fail to move the RSI above 61.8. And this is what I call the worst type of negative divergence. This is when you make new highs and the RSI fails to move above 61.8. If you have not had this before, this being the worst type of negative divergence, this is because it's my own researched method. And we can see ever since that high, obviously the stock has gradually drifted lower. So be aware of the worst type of negative divergences. Eric Moore with mother.com. As always, good luck, peace, and blessings. E, a C, S. Woo, yeah. Woo.